Hey everybody, welcome to today's show. Welcome to Equality and Rights for All. I'm your host, Anthony Larito Duke, and we have a wonderful topic for today's show in which uh, it is President Biden has signed the $1.9 trillion uh, economic stimulus bill today. And uh, so let's get right into this topic. This bill is going to ho- is going to help so many people, and it's going to really boost the economy back. And <clears throat> and um, this is also going to really bring back the economy in a big way because a big chunk of this bill is going to go towards uh, the vaccines, and um. So that's really going to help a lot of people. And uh, President Biden is going to sign an executive order ordering uh, for all the states to have all the adults vaccinated by May 1st. And so that's going to be a a big help. A big help. And... um, in, in so many ways, and there's going to be businesses that are going to be able to uh, to get money from this. So it's going to help uh, businesses out that have been struggling. Uh, um, parents with children are going to get a whole lot of money. The fourteen hundred dollars stimulus checks are going to go out to people. So this is going to help out in a big, major way. All right. And um, so uh, I'm, I'm glad that this was done, and this should have been done by a prior um, administration, but it takes Democrats to get things done. And when Republicans are in, are in control, guess what? They don't get a damn thing done. Okay? So... I'm glad that this is finally getting done and lots more people are going to be able to get vaccinated very soon. And, you know, hopefully by May, everyone will be able to get vaccinated fully. So this is such a great, great thing. And um, so this has been a very progressive day. And that's why if people have been watching the stock market, the stock market boomed. It really uh, came back big time. And um, so things are on the right path. And this is what I've been saying for so long. Things are going so well right now. And we don't want any of the damn idiots to screw it up. And I'm talking, when I say the idiots, I'm talking about those that refuse to wear face, uh, face masks, uh, refuse to social distance, and so and so on and so forth. You know, we've come so far. We worked so hard to get this far. And we don't need for idiots to screw it up. So, you know, we're not out of the woods just yet, but we are getting there. We are almost there. We're almost at that finish line. So we just have a little while to go. And, you know, um... And I know people are anxious to get, you know, uh, to get back to life and stuff. And the CDC even said that um, for those people that uh, get fully vaccinated, they can now be around their loved ones and hug their loved ones. When was the last time that we heard that, ladies and gentlemen? To be able to to see and to hold your loved ones that you haven't seen in a year or so, to be able to hold them and hug them and to tell tell them that that you love them. So this is what I'm saying. This is progress. We're in the right direction. We don't want to ruin this. So um, this is really a great thing. And, you know, there's going to be people out there that are going to tear this down and look at the negative and then stuff like that. And we really got to stop the nonsense because this is a very good thing. 
And this bill also helps out farmers, um, uh, people of color farmers, you know, and and just so many other people. Honestly, and there's going to be other bills being worked on too. And you know, because not not uh, not everything is in this bill that people wanted. But give it time, and there's going to be other bills coming, okay? And that's going to get passed seriously. So just give it a little bit more time to those other people that, uh, who wanted, like, everything in this one bill. Just give it time, and things will work out. And so with that, because um, I really can't uh, uh, spend too long on today's show, so... I want to remind all my fans out there, don't forget to go to my business, my website, which is Advocate Information Highway. The link to there is awldny.com. You guys can check out all the pages on there. And after I'm done hosting this episode uh, for this show, I will host another episode of my show, Advocate Information Highway, on YouTube. And so with that, take care, everybody. Bye.